Are you like me that you really like Sublime Text but want to enable some Vim key bindings? Well, Sublime Text has a mode for that. It's called Vintage Mode, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to enable it. First, though, if you like videos where I show you how to install and set up software, make sure to subscribe. Okay, so I've got a Ruby file open here, and we've got the typical mode of Sublime Text with typical key bindings, but I want to enable those Vim key bindings. That's easy. I can do Control Shift P to bring up my preferences, and I'm going to look for Preferences colon Settings. I'm going to go there, and I've got this line that uh, Sublime Text generated, Ignore Packages Vintage. To get vintage mode, all I have to do is delete this ignored packages. Now, if Sublime Text hasn't auto-generated that already, all you really need to do here is just, let's get rid of all this stuff, is just put this line of code right in here and save it, okay? So now, if I go back to this file and hit escape, I can go and do my Vim key bindings. Cool. Now, one thing you may notice is that when you initially enable vintage mode, it starts in insert mode. So if you really want the default behavior of Vim, where it starts in no normal mode, you can do that too. So I'm going to bring back my command palette with Control shift p search for preferences, so preferences, I want preferences, colon, settings. And down here at the bottom, and maybe I should move down via the Vim method, okay, I'm going to just add uh, a line here, and it's going to be uh, vintage underscore start underscore in underscore command underscore mode and we're going to set that to true like so and I'm going to save it okay all right so now I'm going to quit out of sublime text and restart and as you can see here I'm starting with that block cursor because I'm in normal mode now okay so now I've got pretty much uh, a very vimy feel to my sublime text editor Hopefully this video helped you out. If it did, could you please give it a like as it will help the video out. Thank you.